We're looking forward to gathering on Sunday, 9 and 11 in the house. Such a great time last weekend over Easter. Good Friday was so special with the orchestra that we had and the music that worshiped Jesus for what he did for us, celebrating his resurrection. The place was full on Sunday. It was really a great feeling in the room. What makes that feeling great is that we're connecting with our faith to Jesus and who he is and what he's done for us this week. And we follow up the resurrection. We're gonna talk about his ascension and there's a word that describes what happened before he ascended the transfiguration. He was transfigured. He shone so brightly. It actually frightened those disciples that were with him. They fell on their faces and Jesus said, don't be afraid. You find this in Matthew 17. And when they looked up, it says all they saw was Jesus. It struck me when I read that, that if we could just look up and all we see is Jesus, we'd be in a good place. We see too many other things, too many distractions, too many things that cause us fear. But if we could see Jesus for who he is, he calms our fears and he gives us power, he gives us hope, he gives us vision. And that's what it's all about going forward. We have vision to reach people and help them understand how great the love of Jesus is for them. This weekend, Saturday, there's an outreach for our children from five to eight, a great opportunity for parents to even have a night out while the kids are having a great experience. Many are coming, new families are coming because of what's happening in our children's outreach. Into the month of May, it's all about outreach. In fact, this Sunday, the grocery giveaway happens again. Our men's group takes groceries to the homeless, prays for them, connects with them. We have a partnership with World Vision, equipment that's coming our way that we can give out and make connections with people to help them understand who Jesus is. The outreach opportunities that are in front of us are profound, wonderful, and beautiful. Sunday night, we have wonder, a time to worship Jesus. What strikes me is what we'll talk about Sunday morning, if we could just look up and see Jesus, that we only see him. We're gonna give an opportunity for that Sunday. At five o'clock, we're gonna to gather together for wonder, worship, and pray and believe God for a great outpouring of his spirit. Amazing things are ahead. I'm so excited that you're on the journey with us and that together we can experience his grace, his power, his wisdom. Everything that's about Jesus is what we wanna be about. Hope to see you Sunday, 9 and 11. We'll always be online. You can access that anytime. We're believing God to lead us into great impact to reach our community for his glory and for eternal purposes.